As we reflect on the sun, we are reminded of its immense power and the vast energy it radiates throughout our solar system. It is difficult to imagine anything surpassing the brilliance and force of our sun. However, beyond this familiar celestial body lies an astronomical marvel that dwarfs even the most colossal of stars. This giant is a red supergiant known as Betelgeuse, sometimes mispronounced as Voju or Vito Ru, a stellar enigma whose sheer size, unpredictable behavior, and pulsating nature continue to puzzle scientists. Betelgeuse is situated within the constellation Orion and is so massive and mysterious that even our most advanced technology struggles to fully comprehend it. Its vast diameter, irregular pulsations, and fluctuating brightness make it an object of intense scientific investigation. Researchers using tools like the James Webb Space Telescope have delved deeper into the secrets of this star, discovering phenomena that could challenge our current understanding of stellar physics and cosmic evolution. For those intrigued by the mysteries of the universe, you can stay informed by subscribing to our channel, liking the video, and enabling notifications for updates. Interestingly, many people don't realize that Betelgeuse is actually visible in the night sky during the winter months in the Northern Hemisphere. To spot it, simply look up and locate the constellation Orion. Betelgeuse marks the upper left shoulder of Orion's rectangular shape and shines with a distinctive reddish-orange hue, making it one of the brightest stars in the night sky. Despite its brightness, careful observers will notice that Betelgeuse's light isn't steady. It's Luminosity changes over time due to its classification as a pulsating red supergiant. From Earth it may seem like just another bright dot among countless stars, but it's located over 640 light-years away, a distance that truly illustrates its remoteness. To put this in perspective, even if we could travel at the speed of light, the journey to Betelgeuse would take over six centuries. With current space travel technology, such a trip would take over 12 million years a time frame far exceeding the entirety of human civilization. The dimming and brightening of Betelgeuse aren't merely due to its distance, its pulsations, expansions, and contractions of its outer layers. Result in observable changes in brightness that occur over cycles lasting from tens to hundreds of days. Remarkably, its magnitude can range from 0.5 to 1.6, at times becoming extremely bright, and at other times significantly dim. The shortest pulsation cycle is around 185 days, while the longest stretches to 2,335 days. In February 2021, Betelgeuse reached a historic low in brightness, baffling scientists and sparking widespread interest. Apart from its fluctuating brightness, Betelgeuse is also noted for its cool surface temperature, around 3,500 Kelvin, which gives it its reddish appearance. This is significantly cooler than the sun's surface temperature of 5,500 Kelvin, which means it emits less energy per unit area. Despite its lower temperature, Betelgeuse is a colossal star, roughly 20 times the mass of the sun, making it one of the largest known stars in terms of volume. This extraordinary size and behavior have drawn scientific attention for centuries. The star was first identified by the ancient Greek astronomer Ptolemy, and its Arabic name translates to Orion's armpit. While early astronomers couldn't observe its detailed characteristics, modern instruments have opened new frontiers. The Hubble Space Telescope, for instance, has provided intricate images of Betelgeuse's surface, showing complex gas and dust formations. These insights have helped astronomers develop models to predict its evolution and behavior. Another critical tool in studying Betelgeuse is the Atacama Large Millimeter Submillimeter Array, ALMA, located in Chile. ALMA has captured high-resolution images that reveal remarkable features of the star's structure. One such discovery is a massive plume of gas extending from its surface, believed to be the result of convection, a process in which hot gas rises while cooler gas sinks. This dynamic movement causes waves that travel through the star's atmosphere driving the pulsations and size changes we observe. Thanks to these observations, scientists have also identified dark spots on Betelgeuse's surface, akin to sunspots but far larger. Known as star spots, these regions are cooler than their surroundings due to intense magnetic activity, 
which restricts the flow of gas from the interior to the surface. Betelgeuse's magnetic field is estimated to be thousands of times stronger than the sun's, leading to the creation of magnetic loops and arcs that trap gas and form these vast spots. These star spots are not exclusive to Betelgeuse. Similar phenomena are seen on other stars, including our sun. However, Betelgeuse's spots are particularly noteworthy because they are several times larger than Earth and can cover up to 20% of the star's surface. As they rotate in and out of view, they contribute to the star's irregular brightness. Combined with its pulsations, these factors cause Betelgeuse's luminosity to vary significantly over time. Surprisingly, Betelgeuse is not entirely unique. It has stellar counterparts that share some of its extraordinary traits. One such star is Antares, another red supergiant, located in the constellation Scorpius. Like Betelgeuse, Antares is a variable star, undergoing changes in brightness. It has about 12 times the mass of the Sun and a radius 700 times larger, making it another cosmic giant worthy of study. All. This raises a fascinating question. Has Betelgeuse already exploded in a supernova, and is the light from that event still on its way to us? Given its distance, we might not witness such a cosmic event for centuries, even if it has already occurred. Let us know what you think in the comments. If you enjoyed this deep dive into the cosmos, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and stay tuned for more celestial insights. Thank you for watching. We'll see you again soon.